Hey, what's up everybody? Adam Marcy with UFC 3 Tips and Tricks. In this video, we're going to go over something that I know a lot of you have trouble with. And I know something it's something that I had trouble with up until a month or two ago when our beloved member of the community, Anthony Romero17, showed me this tip. So shout out to Romero. He's where I learned this tip. Now I'm hopefully going to teach you guys something. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, but you guys have noticed that the body lock high slam, oops, that's not what I meant to do. Hold on. I smash Connor. I smash him. So the body lock high slam, when you push your opponent up against the cage, it oftentimes changes sides. So sometimes it'll be um, the right direction and sometimes it'll be the left direction. And I was always confused as hell as to why this is. Now, while I can't claim to know why it switches sides, I do know a surefire way to always defend against it. And this is how you do it. So when you're McGregor, as, I, as you see, I switched to the McGregor controls. When you're pushed up against the cage, you'll see the over-under transition, right? Every time you get pushed up against the cage, you'll see that over-under available. Whichever direction the over-under is, that's how you'll ultimately deny the body lock high slam. So I don't have two controllers here, obviously, but if Khabib were to go into that body lock high slam animation, it would most definitely be R2 and right. And if we test it out, we see that right here. So know this, when you're pushed up against the cage, whichever direction the over-under transition is, R2 and that direction will block the body lock high slam. And this, of course, is the same thing if Khabib were to go to the single leg position. As you see, he also has the body lock high slam. And as you see, McGregor's over under is still pointing right. That's how he would block the body lock high slam. So real quick, just to show you what I was talking about before. I let these two boys off the cage. I push Conor back. And what do you know? When I go to Conor McGregor's control, the over under is now left and I can't claim to know why the hell that is. All I know is that if you go to Khabib's control, sure enough, to perform the body lock high slam, you have to go left. So, real quick, when you're pushed up against the cage, look for the over-under transition, and that's how, you that's how you know the direction to deny for the body lock high slam. Thank you guys so much for viewing this video. I know I helped a shitload of people out there, because when Romero told me this, I was like, holy crap, how did I not know that? And it's so helpful at the same time. So thank you guys for watching. Let me know if this video helped you below. Go to our channel and check out all the premieres that we have lined up coming up over this week. And click set reminder. Look at Khabib's big toe. It kind of looks weird. It's like a very long and detailed big toe. But it kind of looks like a raptor. But anyway, press set reminder on the videos that you want to see. And if you want to join any of our crazy innovative leagues, check the description. Everything's there for you. All right, guys. Thank you so much. See you in the next video. Peace.